It is time to hop into those Easter plans. This cherished holiday is the perfect time for family traditions, gatherings, and indulging in some of your favorite sweet treats. No celebration would be complete without an Easter basket filled with small gifts, toys, eggs, and of course, chocolate bunnies. And no one can create a more delicious basket than Master Lint Chocolatier Ann Zaja. She joins us now with some irresistible tips. But first, Ann, you have such a dream job. How did you become a master chocolatier? Thank you, Michelle. Yes, I, it is a wonderful job. I uh, was living and working in Switzerland. I was working in restaurants and I developed a real passion for their chocolate. And I did a traditional apprenticeship as a pastry chef chocolatier. And I have been with Lint nearly 20 years now. How did the gold bunny tradition start and then evolve into what it is today? It's the sweetest story. There was a little girl watching a real bunny hopping around the backyard and it hopped away as bunnies do. And her dad was a master chocolatier and to comfort her because she was very upset with this bunny leaving, he created a gold bunny and that was part of their tradition going forward that she would do a hunt in the yard for the bunny and then it grew into something bigger and now gold bunny has been part of our traditions for over 70 years. What are some tips to assembling the perfect Easter basket? Well, I like to customize them, of course, as we all do. So um, I figure out what the people really like, the types of chocolate they like, and I start with Gold Bunny as my hero, and then I build it up in layers. So I will add other small pieces of chocolate or maybe a little stuffed animal or toy. And one of the things I really enjoy doing is buying one of those large plastic eggs, and I fill it up with more chocolate. What do chocolatiers do with some of the leftover chocolate? I'm curious about that. Well, if there is any leftover chocolate, right? I love to chop it up. I bake, so I love to make chocolate chip cookies with it. I will put it into my pancake recipe. And I also love to create my own hot chocolate. So I just add it to steamed milk. And then I put a big dollop of whipped cream to finish it off. It's delicious. Tell us about the location you're at today and how someone could win a chance to stay there this Easter. It is amazing. I am in Carlsbad, California, and Lint took over this beautiful seaside home, and I'm surrounded by over 2,700 pieces of chocolate in this house. And you can enter to stay here over Easter weekend. You just visit Lint goldbunnygetaway.com, and you can sign up, and the um, sign up is open through 11.59 p.m. on the 12th of March. Okay, thanks, Anne. We really appreciate it. Thank you for having me.